smart on crime. We just think some of the bills that have been filed are not being very smart. Community and state leaders in Shreveport worry for local youth and young adults, while Louisiana lawmakers decide on new criminal reform bills, saying the new policies could be harmful. We see bills that we think are going to keep people in jail longer, such as curving our, our eligibility for parole, uh, such as getting rid of good time behavior. The whole idea of juvenile proceedings is just that. We don't want a record following someone because of some mistake they made when they were below the age of discernment. Yes. All it's going to do is affect that person's ability to get a job and become a good citizen. Yes. So there are a lot of uh, uh, concerns. State Senator Sam Jenkins says crime has actually gotten worse and for the youth after their reform in 2017. If you're going to begin to make criminals out of the first incident that a juvenile make, all you're doing now is setting an atmosphere, as a councilman was just saying a few moments ago, where you're not building. Tammy Phelps highlighted disappointing efforts made. Um, a, a, violent, a violation in the schools. Hey, let's screen them and see what's going on, talk about the mental health issue. Of course, voted down, but the very next bill came from the Senate side, and it was, we'll screen them to know which facility, juvenile facility, to send them to. Jenkins and others believe education will help get to the root of their issues with criminal activity. The states that are getting it right are those who are bringing some balance. And that balance comes from preventive measures, intervention measures, to try to address crime. Now, those leaders who spoke out said they can only do so much from their position and ask the public to encourage change by reaching out to their local legislation and sharing their feedback and needs. Reporting live in Shreveport, Maya Nicholson, NBC6 News. All right, thank you very much, Maya.